we have done that. And in that last, best, and final offer, we have said no to the change in the retiree medical benefit. We have offered a way forward to partner with the city in a rational way to address that issue, but not, as I said, and I'll say it again, not by giving in with a gun to our head because we don't want a pay cut. So if the city is going to go down this path, and the city council is going to vote to impose a pay cut and to impose these, these takeaways in the retiree medical benefit, we will see them in every court of law that will happen. Today is the day, ladies and gentlemen, for each of you knowing what is at stake for yourselves and, and for your families to join us in the council chambers to stand behind your negotiating team members who have labored so long and hard to try to find a way out of this miserable problem to stand with them and make sure that when this decision is made as it will be today by the City Council, that they understand your point of view, that they respect your position, and that they make a decision that is based on having a fair outcome for you who, who actually make this city run every day so that the residents get the services that they expect uh, from this city. And without you, they would not have those services. And without your efforts, uh, on a daily basis, grinding away, doing the work with fewer people and fewer resources, they would not have uh, the value that they have in the government that you cause the city to be able to provide. So join us in rallying through this concourse, raising your voices so that they hear them on the 11th floor and on the 10th floor, and join us in the council chambers so that every phase and every story uh, gets told, at least through your presence, that you support your union and that you support the efforts that we've made to try to give the city a way forward that is more productive than destructive and that causes us, at least in the future, to be able to find a better outcome to our conflicts than we have been able to do in the past. So join us, keep the faith, don't be discouraged. Uh, we have another round to go, uh, and the City Council is where we are taking our case now that the road has, we have come to the end of the road with the mayor. So thank you for coming out. It's great to see so many of you. Keep the faith, get hard, and stand strong. All right. You know what? I said this last time, you know, we're being more than fair. And if they want to play hardball, this is the one to do it right here, Ann Smith. Right. Okay, I'd like to introduce uh, Bob Cook, first vice president. He's going to lead you here. We're going to march around this building several times just to let him know.